This question is from just 2016. We did it once, but there was a mistake. Thank you, Selajit Chakrabarti, for pointing out the mistake. So let's redo it again. The maximum relativistic kinetic energy of beta particles from a radioactive nucleus is equal to rest mass energy of the particle. So it is given kinetic energy is equal to m naught c square rest mass energy. Here m naught is the rest mass. Now a magnetic field is applied perpendicular to beam of beta particles which bends it to a circle of radius r. When a charged particle of charge E and velocity V enters into a magnetic field which is perpendicular, then it experiences a Lorentz force. Lorentz force is equal to Q into V cross B. Now when it is perpendicular, when V and B are perpendicular, this is simply QVB. Sin 90 degree is 1 and we are only interested in magnitude. So if charge is E, then we have EVB. Now this EVB is equal to centripetal force. Centripetal force is equal to mv square by r in non-relativistic case, but when it comes to m not v square by r in non-relativistic case, but when it comes to relativistic cases, we have a gamma factor extra. Now this can be written as P V divided by R is equal to E V B. Here P is equal to gamma M naught V. P is not equal to M naught V. This is only true in non-relativistic cases. P is equal to gamma M naught V. Where gamma is equal to 1 by root of 1 minus v square upon c square. Now from pv by r is equal to evb we get p is equal to p is equal to ebr. Let us name this equation 1. We will come back here later. Now let us use the formula for relativistic momentum in terms of kinetic energy. p is equal to 1 by c into root of k into k plus 2m naught c square. This is equal to 1 by c times under root k is given to be k is kinetic energy k is given to be equal to m naught c square m naught c square times m naught c square plus 2m naught c square this is equal to 1 by c times 3 m naught square c raised to 4. This is equal to 1 by c times root 3 m naught c square which is equal to root 3 m naught c. This is equation 2. Now let us equate the RHS of equation 1 and equation 2. Then we will get root 3 m naught c is equal to E B R or B is equal to root 3 M naught C divided by E R. Therefore the correct answer here is option C.